people have a fear of something that's new because they've had this, you know, it's tradition, it's this way or that way. Um, you know, we've always had it, this is the way it has to be. It doesn't have to be like that. It was scary because it was new and it was change and people are afraid of change. Um, like I said, I was, and I looked more and more into it and I, and, and I started to see how we could make this change very positive for our chapter. This experience, the TG experience and the program that's set forth um, is really a more all-encompassing um, ordeal that will help um, not just new members but the entire fraternity um, from first year to fourth year become better members, become better people of society, better citizens. This change allows us to really recruit members year-round and force our current active members to act in a way that demands excellence out of everybody and we all, we all have to hold each other accountable. This keeps people accountable, this keeps people you know, ahead of the game, this keeps people educated. You're not changing your beliefs and your values and those are the people that you want. You're, you're selling them as, as a recruitment chairman the experience. The fraternity and society itself is ever changing, ever evolving. I think this allows us to make sure that we recruit and retain the best collegiate men possible in our chapters. I'm a better man now than I was when I was initiated. Um, that's the way I like to look at it. You know, I think that some of the great leaders that don't want to put up with hazing or waiting to lead are going to go SAE because they know that they're in their immediate future. They can hold positions, they can take responsibilities, they can make things happen for the chapter, and, uh, and they can have that respect and that acceptance right off the bat.